So you've got one of these, and maybe it has one of these. That's right, the CD-DVD-ROM drive. Remember this thing? Maybe you wanna make one of these. It's a CD or DVD, but you've forgotten how to do it, or maybe someone hasn't shown you how. Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how easy it is to burn onto a CD or DVD. This is Wrestling With Tech, where I wrestle with tech so that you don't have to. So I promised you easy and it really couldn't be any easier. The first thing you have to do is make sure that you have a blank CD or DVD. Next thing you do obviously is open up your drive. Then once you do that, you put the disc right in the drive, you push it in, you're gonna hear it start up and then within a couple seconds, you're gonna get a prompt on the screen and then you take it from there. Okay, and here's the prompt. It's asking me two things. I can either use this as a USB flash drive, which means it's gonna become a data disk. And with that data disk, I can import files, photos, um, pretty much using it like a flash drive and store things on. Or I can select to burn a CD DVD, which then allows me to either play this, if I'm using music, to play this in a CD player, or if I want to uh, burn video, I can set it so that it'll work with a DVD player. Okay, so what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna select that I wanna use this as a flash drive so that I can transfer some photos onto the disk. It also asks me to name the, uh, the data disk, so I can name it whatever I want, Alex's pictures, family vacation, whatever it is. So now it's formatting my drive, my CD, to, uh, to match the data disk. And that'll just take a second. So now it's formatting my disk to be a data disk, and all of a sudden I've got this great little window here, and I promise you simple, let me show you how easy it is. I'm gonna open up my pictures folder because this is where the photos are located. I'm going to take this folder that says my pics, I'm gonna drop it in there, and now all of a sudden I've got that in there. So now that I transferred my pics into the folder, I can decide if I want to transfer more files to it or I can just very simply take my files and delete it or move it. And this acts as if it was a flash drive, which means that you can delete files and you can add to it. So that's a really nice feature to have. Okay, so to burn a audio CD or a video DVD, you put in your blank CD DVD into the ROM drive there, and then within a matter of seconds, you're gonna get that prompt again asking whether you wanna use it as a USB flash drive or with a CD DVD player. Now, you have the option, it's asking me for a disc title, I can change the name so I can make it Alex's Mix if I wanted to, and then I'm gonna select CD DVD player. Now I get this screen again. It's very similar to the screen before, but let me show you why it's different. I'm gonna open up my music file. So I've got a couple songs here. I'm just gonna select for the sake of making this quick. I'm just gonna select one file for now. That's it. And then I need to go to share, and when I go to share, I hit burn to disk. And what that is going to do is, it's gonna burn all of the music files that I have onto my CD, and now I have an audio CD that I can play in my car or play uh, in any type of CD player. Just keep in mind that you have to choose whether you wanna make this a CD or a DVD. There's two different types of media that you can buy. You can either buy a CD or buy a DVD. So make sure that you're purchasing the correct one for your particular needs. So that's it. Now you have your very own burnt DVD or CD. If this video provided value to you, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if there's something that you want me to make a video on, please leave it in the comment section or message me on social media and I'll do my very best to do so. So until then, I'll see you guys next time.